Oh my god, the mosquitoes. All right. There are toes on this son of a bitch. Look at that. One, two, three, four. Big toe there. That is a foot. Get your hand out of the... That is a foot. Where are the toes? Okay, well, this is the big toe right here. There's a tiny toe there. You see an indentate, indentation. There, 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 too. My foot, size 10 shoe, but from outside like that, it's like 13. So that's a small foot for a big foot. But Unless uh, somebody was out here with... No, they would not be out here on the power line. To take a view of where we're at on the power line. Apartments out that that way. Look at the distance here. That's a big foot foot. It's the only one I see though. I'm gonna go on that side. Yeah, get a better yeah. view. Pull these plants out of the way. Now I can see the toes. Can you see it better? Yeah. You see how their toes in there? Who's wearing? Oh, fuck it, mosquitoes. Who's wearing no shoes back here? Two, hey, you know what? Two, two. Look at the direction that foot's coming from, too. It goes that way into this underbrush. It doesn't even follow the path we're on. That's a big toe. That is a big foot. Look at the toesies there, so. Now you can see it. There's the big one. Two, toe, 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 toe. Two. Toe. Is there any other ones like That's that? That's a big, big footprint. I was looking at the tracks and we were seeing deer. Lots of deer. Um, yeah, I see the people's um, toy dogs. But no other. I kind of want to mark this to be honest. But if the people on four wheelers come through again, they're going to destroy it. Destroy it. Here's that big board right there. Put the board by it. I wish we had. Um, plaster or something we'd make Yeah, space. that's what I was hoping, wishing we could make. Yeah, just like that. We'll be able to find it. And if someone drives, it's directly in the center though, so someone may not drive on. I'm a size 11. It really isn't that big of a print. Well, it's like outside, a size 14 maybe? Yeah, but on the outside of your shoe, not the inside of the shoe, you gotta add like five or six sizes. Mm -hmm. Alright, set it off until unless you see another footprint, half open. a part of one that's a heel. No. No, it is. It's just. Wow, look at these mosquitoes. Killing me. It's bad out here. What the hell is it? It made a path. No, this is just. Oh, here's the old sand cloud. Look at this. Hmm. There's an old sand cloud. There's also a lot more prints over there. Well, there's human shoe prints over there. Big shoe prints. Alright, really so this shoe has to prints. be overgrown now for about 15 years, I think. Sorry oh, if I move this too much. Look at how mosquitoes overgrown. being a pain in the butt. Is. Dark, really good prints here. here. Yeah. Wish it could be cast. Putting casts on. These are old prints. Let me see the trace marks. Yeah, they're all just normal stuff. Deer, people, dog. And that one's a foot with toes. Bet you could definitely tell toes. Yeah, I guess that is. But it seems... Oh, there goes my shoe. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. I that was, was going my to shoe. say... See, this one's a foot with toes. That's my shoe. I'm trying to get somewhere safer. Remind me not to bring you on an archaeological dig. You just, like, completely ruined all the evidence. This one's toes. That indent like that. But this is a really good one, but it's my size foot again. Well, there was a boot print right next to it, which showed the difference between a lighter person stepping on it and a heavy person stepping on that. That's true. See? But look at that uh, coyote print over there, too. See them? 
That's not coyote, Mom. That's a dog. I, I just don't see a human walking back here barefoot. Hmm. You know, I don't care how good their feet are. Mm -hmm. Their damn feet. And here's the other thing. Is that footprint... Maybe we got Squatch here. ...to there, and he probably jumped from there to over here. They just seem really small for a squatch print. There's more here. Somebody got stuck. I think they were chasing that deer print. Oh, look at those prints. Mm-hmm. Along the right hand side over there. This one's got. Oh, this one's got middle. clear. Clear. Um. Toes. Very clear toes. Toe. 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 The only thing I can think of is there is a brand of shoe that makes shoes that are. They have toes on the ends of them. Okay, but here's the my only thing. thing I can think of. When you see it like that, that brand of shoe still has a tread thing on the bottom, and you don't see any of the tread like you do see the feet. Mm. So. Hmm. And then their other side, I don't know. I think what, that's a person. Uh, I don't know, though. Again, I'm not sure, because um, that's extremely deep but extremely thin. But if you look in this way, there's toes again. So these actually filled up. Can you let me go first? Whoever it was went that way and then they came back this way. So they walked that way and then walked this way. Mm hmm Let me go first. Oh, there's a Tupperware bin. I hope there's not a dead body in there. Don't see anything Only in it. Only reason to transport a bin like that out this way. Take a bag, dude. I have a lot to show. I thought I heard somebody walking in tandem with us. Oh dear slots. Oh, look at these logs. I wonder how long they've been cut down. Shh. Probably just a deer. But there's something crashing through the leaves over there. Could be a bear too. But he's a going straight. Mm. As long as we make it's noise probably just a deer, because it's early in the morning. Well, as long as we make noise and they know we're here, they won't bother us. Yeah, see, I just heard it. That's probably a deer. Sound like a deer stamp. There it goes again. All this just to find a damn big footprint to see the boots. Nice squatches. Uh, squatch. Um, nice slots. Right here. Deer slot, slots, yeah. Yeah. Look at these logs right here. Yeah, I know. I saw this them. This is where your woodpeckers come. Um, but these, this one's just boot prints. Another boot print right here. This one's got, I think, or he's just really stuck. I don't know. Sarah, I really don't think that dog. But this one has it too. That's the footprint. I didn't even look over there. That's it's like there's somebody back here with a dog, and that Bigfoot trailed them <laughs> to see what the hell they were doing. This is me stepping on it. But we're women, Bigfoot don't I'm 250 the pounds. Oops. But it didn't go that far down. A 250 pound person couldn't indent it, but look at how deep that is. So that's double the depth, would be like 400 pound? Yeah, it's done. There's another one. More deer slots. This one's going off into the woods, though. And look at the size of that one. That almost looks like a boot, though. It's rounded. It looks that's like a boot. Yeah, and it's got the. The uh, tread, tread on the bottom too. No, like I said, there's, there was a little bit of tread. Here. 
Ooh. Right there, there's a tread for a boot. So that's a boot. Yeah, there's a person back here with a dog or some so. But, uh, the Bigfoot was trapping his ass. Probably wants it to be gone, because that's not a small man. And this is, when you see the, um, when we go back that way, I'll show you the train tracks again. That are all overgrown, overgrown. Very pretty here. It's got prime big foot traveling tags so that people don't see them. If you run out of memory on your phone, sorry. I probably will. I don't know if you could continue taping, but I guess uh, longer the tape, the less one. uncut. That's a foot. That's a foot. That's a foot. That one has the toes and he slid. This one has the a piece of the tread. It's like a round thing and some more tread right here. Yeah, that's a boot. 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 That one's foot. You could even see the toes again. Yeah. And that goes up in between. The arch, that's like a perfect print. That's perfect, <laughs> yeah. Bug. But like I said, they were going this way. So he made the trip down that way, and then he made the trip back this way. And here's that international Bigfoot. I'm really wondering if the Bigfoot's traveling with a freaking Kai dog. I swear that's a Kai dog print tear. That's Koi not... dog, and it's not. It's a dog. I don't think so. So he's dog canine print. It's canine, yeah, but I don't think that's dog. Pretty sure it is. Bigfoot, possibly, print. That's a really good one, too. I really wish we could cast these. Yeah, I wish I had stuff. A whole bunch. Let's try not to step on them. That was probably the most detailed looking one. Detailed looking Bigfoot prints I've ever seen. You know what I Only should be doing? And this is the International Bigfoot Highway. The power line going that way, going that way. Show the people around. This is how you get around the country without anybody seeing you. This is how those two convicts tried getting back into Canada. Mm -hmm. Now there's a road over there you have to cross, but then you clear onto the into the forest again. So what I should be looking for is. Uh, hair caught on branches on the way back. It's it's not on any bushes or anything that would snag anything. You want to keep going? More nice slots right here. Those are really nice slots. That's one big deer print. Right White-tailed there. deer. See well, it kind of slid in the mud a little. You think that's a slide? Mm -hmm. I'm looking from all the way back here. So it's not too bad. Well, there's tiny ones too. There was a fawn. And there's a froggy. Where are you, Buffalo? It's Buffalo. <laughs> Americano. <laughs> I don't like saying Buffalo because that's the name of the Italian uh, cow that you make liquid out from. I want to go that way. I'd really like to travel this one again. Tell if that cracking wood noise is her walking over there or if it's from that direction. Look, tiny deer prints. Look how tiny they are. Okay. Let's take a good 
bunch of how dark inside how those trees are up over there. Here, look. Oh, it's a root. It looked like a wire to me. A who? It's a root. Hmm. Okay. Now, look at how dark that forest is over You know, how dark that, and that's looking into the sun. When you go back, I want you to take a look at the old railroad track mm -hmm. up and down and how overgrown it is now. Mm -hmm. But how it's like prime. Grandma's the squash hunter in our family. Do you want to show her this video? Yeah, yeah, we're going to show her that video. <laughs> but one big rock comes flying out at us and we are never walking up this way again. <laughs> I start hearing some knocking. We're... Well, I was hearing knocking over there, but I wasn't sure if it was echoing from you stepping on twigs over I wasn't here. stepping on anything. So, that away. <laughs> Want to no, that's the way we don't want to go. <laughs> I don't want to see him. They're knocking for a reason. Oh, little froggy. This species are you? And I'm seeing boots going every which direction over here. So there's definitely people footprints and an old T-shirt right here. That's not it. But this probably came off the Caroline guy's work stuff. If you're a bullfrog, you're a very tiny bullfrog. Oh, you find a bullfrog? I think it's a young one, baby. I think. It's really speckly on the back. I've never seen a young one. A young bullfrog? Put him in the water there. Come back with a can. It's really speckly. Double check what you think you see. The front end looks like it, but it's got so many, like, warty bits on the back. Check this out. Oh, I heard something moving. Turn underneath. Oh, he's injured. Oh, he's probably not going to live long. He's injured. That's why he's not moving too much with me. Put him in the water. Over there, bud. In the water. Throw his ass in the water. Yeah, he's not moving much. Wait. There you go. Try to get better. Check this out. Me touching him didn't help, but... No, you're touching him, well, That's a bullfrog. Yeah, something big was just right over here. Oh, yeah, look at him. He's big. I see his head. Okay, yeah, it's a bullfrog, because I just didn't recognize the warts on the back for a second. Um, slight, tiny and warts. it's kind of clean water, too, because you can see the bottom where it's mucky. Mm-hmm. So, well, there's another one. They're all over over here. Oh, yeah, something big just jumped around in here, so I'm assuming it's frogs. So if you want that um, little piece of little tiny turn, friend, now it's time to take it. But um, what I'm saying is, turn. look at this big chunk of thing that it pulled out mm -hmm. from somewhere. Look at all the More sand. nice little deer slots. Look at all the black sand too. There's definitely gold right here. But it being in New York, no sense trying to dig it up. They just take it from you. Oh look, little baby one. Oh, they're so tiny. They're the baby babies. Little tiny ones. Little fawn came Probably through. Probably baby babies right here somewhere. But yeah, see the deep ruts? Mm -hmm. So, the trucks came here before the last rain. Mm -hmm. I hear another one. It's probably the same I one we just you. went by. I hear you. I don't know where I want to walk. I don't want to walk along on that dirt. Not well, we got to get back, so we should go back that way. I gotta go over there. Okay. I'm gonna go this way. This way. You going that way? I'm going this way. Where's that big one? Thank you.
I thought you would. It's coming your way. Probably gonna get stuck in the road. There's my frog go again. Oh, there he is, right here. Hey, buddy. Oh, there he goes. Losing weight, my pants are falling down. There's some tadpoles. I think I'm seeing it move a lot over here. Unless it's just a bunch of mosquito lava. Larvae, maybe. Well, there is a frog in there. Look at all these footprints. There's a frog hiding down there. So if I want to go hunting, I know where to go. With the frogs. That is probably the good old fashioned quicksand that they kept warning us about <laughs> back in the 60s and 70s that I really thought was going to be a problem when I grew up. All you have to do is lay down flat in it and then kind of like be you know, a lizard and crawl bullshit, out. Right? No, it's not because I that's got stuck in thing. one up to my freaking chest yeah, that, that's muck, and I had to get out like that. Sand. I'm only seeing deer slots out here. Just watching them. Oh, that's the one I wanted to walk up. That way? Mm hmm. Ooh, nice deep one. I guess we ain't going for the Ooh. male. Now that. This is clay. That is not a dog. Oh, it does a little toe prints. That small. Walking in a straight line. There's Bobcat? One there. Straight line is fox. Think that's fox? It looks awfully big for a fox. No, that's the right size. I'm gonna probably double check when I look at my tracking guide track at home. Up the back. The but direction it was coming I'm from. Decently the sure the that's a fox. So there's that one there. The one next to the deer slot. Where was he going? There's another very light one there. He was following this whole, this, uh, track. the trail track thing here, the rivet. And it was dry. Do I see any more over here? No. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I didn't see any more tracks anywhere else. Like, he up and disappeared. He probably jumped. Oh, no, I think right over there. Over there somewhere. I don't know, but I'm pretty sure that's Fox. Those are little tiny ones again. Yeah, they must have just dropped a bunch over here in this area. Oh. Yep, shut it off. We'll be back if we find something interesting. Battery low. Yep, Bye -bye. shut it off. Bye, guys. Oh. Just as I hear branches snapping. Don't worry about branches snapping.